Magandang umaga. Kumusta, guys? So, Bullet right now is with Coach Jerry, with Black Belt Jerry uh, in Manila, putting in work at uh, UFC Gym. And I'm going to put in some work myself right now. I'm going to do some uh, back and biceps, some other pull motions. I'm trying to gain some weight and uh, gain some power for, for IMAG, for Sambo. So, I'm going to do a workout here and then uh, enjoy some time with the family. And I am keeping in touch with Jerry and with Bullet in Manila because I'll be back down in a few days and we got to keep this momentum going until the fight. Oh, and we do have an update from Mr. Foot Fetish, guys. So I sent him a picture, not my real feet, yeah? I, I googled uh, ugly feet, and the first image that came up on Google Images, I sent it to him. And he knew it wasn't my real feet, so he still wants a picture of my real feet now. So what do you think, guys? Easy 50K, just do it. Maybe like Star said, I'll tease him and just send him a picture of my big toe. Only one toe. <laughs> a few moments later. All right, welcome to my home gym in the attic. Basics, guys, but I do have a treadmill courtesy of Johnson Fitness Philippines. Check them out. Uh, great equipment. But yeah, basic equipment here in the attic. I have a few weights. I have a lot of resistance bands. And um, yeah, I had to set this place up during the pandemic because I was still fighting and all the gyms and everything were closed here in the Philippines, unlike the US and other countries where a lot of places still remained open. So I've, uh, I've gathered and amassed workout equipment over the years and I just bought a few more things during the pandemic. A bunch of workout bands and my UFC and one championship gloves. And this is my favorite station right here. DIY, do it yourself, homemade pull up bar. Along with my heavy bag from Payantog Sports. Shout out Payantog, in my opinion, the best uh, locally made boxing and uh, MMA equipment uh, here in the Philippines. All right, before we get started, shout out uh, G Boy Sakalam and Olrax Official. Thanks for tuning in, guys. So one of your questions on the last vlog was about bullet skills um, in BJJ since technically he is a white belt. So one of the things that I have to explain here is that there's a difference between gi and no gi. You only have belt ranking and the belt system in gi training. And gi training is with the uniform. No gi is no gi. There's, not, there's no gi, you're not wearing a gi. MMA is no gi because you're not wearing the uniform when you fight. So technically, Bullet is a white belt, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. And that just means that you haven't trained with the gi enough. So for example, I'm, I'm a purple belt only with the gi. I'm not even a black belt. But in training, I've, I've tapped world champions before and black belts. But with the gi, I've never tapped a world champion or a black belt, only a no gi. So there, there's a difference in the styles. Of, of fighting with the gi and the style of fighting with the no with, without the gi. All right, bicep and back day. Let's get it done. Aren't pretty, but till failure. 
get it like, oh, what I get flow, but I keep that, oh, what I get team, but I got that, whoa, what I get team, but you got that, whoa, get it like, everybody want to feel when I feel like, ooh, hold up on the scene, but I green like, ooh, when I bit a flop, but I thought you knew, when I get chill, what you really want to do, I see the maidens, they be talking, walking all the time, often putting them in the coffin, boffing when they say rhyme, pretty girls dance, hold up, ugly girls Phony people like the only text on holiday. Like happy Easter, Merry Christmas, happy birthday. Happy birthday. It ain't my birthday. We don't talk enough for them to know that don't that hurt. Hey, I don't call them, I don't text them, keep it moving. No protection, intersection, combination. I'm just moving recollections. A few hours later. Where do you want to go? You want to go see Sa? Oh. Pew. Pew. Hey guys, Zoe's asleep. We are at CLA right now. It's Christian Legacy Academy. It's my wife's uh, school that her family runs. And I also teach PE here. like a dragonfly with your eyes. Hindi ko pa alam. Yeah, no eyes. Big eyes. Hindi ko pa alam. But dying that the dragonflies didn't have eyes. It's date night at SM. And here's some, uh, here's some training footage of you guys from Bullet. I just got it from Coach Jerry, so uh, here's some uh, highlights of today's training at UFC Gym. Close here, guys. We got a, a bear at Toy Kingdom for Maxi because he was begging for a bear right before we left for our date night. Anyway, Bullet said he had a great training session in Manila. I have full trust in Coach Jerry. Coach Jerry's the man. Thanks, Jerry, for. Hey, what's up, guys? <laughs> Jerry's the man. So, uh, yeah, just comment down below, guys, if you have any questions. And, uh, yeah, final stretch now. I'm pumped. Bullet told me that he's super sore from training, so that's a good sign. Train hard, fight easy. Thanks for watching, guys. God bless. Ingat. <laughs>